Hey guys, welcome back. I am feeling really, really good. Like genuinely so good. I feel like Okay, so I'm doing like all of my decluttering and everything. I did film a makeup declutter for the people who requested it. So those videos are coming. I'm gonna like I'm pre-filming all of them obviously. And then I'm gonna kind of put them up periodically here and there just so I don't like clog down my feed with all declutter videos. Um, and then I'm also going to do a video like redoing my bathroom and everything like that. It's gonna be great. I really feel though like I feel so good after having this done um, in so much of my house. And I really feel like this is almost like a fresh start for me and my channel and things like that. And I'm so, like, you have no idea just how freeing it is. It's so freaking freeing. And it's not just like the makeup. It's like my whole house, you know. It's so, oh, I feel so good. So good. Today we are going to be doing a subscription box unboxing for kind of a new box. I used to be subscribed to this box. Um, it's the Cause Box. I used to be subscribed to Cause Box, but I ended up canceling my subscription a couple years ago. Um, but now that I'm starting to try to be like a little bit more environmentally friendly, I decided to go ahead and resubscribe, especially now because now they've got like the Marketplace, which is like their version of add-ons. You can make choices if you pay yearly, and I really like the perks that they've added, so I decided to resubscribe and try out the box again. So today we are going to be unboxing that. Um, I just, you know, I want to chat for a minute. So I'll leave a, a timestamp down below for when the unboxing starts, if that's all you're interested in, if you're just here for the unboxing. But if you are a subscriber to my channel, then let's just chat for a second. I feel so much better, like genuinely about everything. And I posted in my community tab a couple days ago about just, just different things that I was going to be doing, the newish direction that the channel is going in. I'm feeling really, really good about that. Just a few more lifestyle videos, things like that. I'm really excited. I have been accepted as a member of the Ipsy open studio which means that Ipsy will be sending me a couple of their bags every month so because of that I am actually canceling the bags that I already have um since I'm going to get them in PR I guess I'm very excited like I'm so excited because as you guys know Ipsy is one of my favorite subscription boxes I was considering canceling the Ipsy glam bag um like the sample one because I'm kind of moving away from samples but I really got to think I was really thinking about it and I actually, like, I do like trying the sample sizes. I just don't like hoarding them. So I feel like if I can just use the samples as I get them instead of hoarding them, I would enjoy it a lot more. Um, just like a couple videos ago when I was talking about using the products that I get in subscription boxes instead of just putting them in my drawers and hoping they come up in a random number generator. I also think I might end up getting rid of like my beauty inventory and doing a shop my stash the traditional way. I might not do it every two weeks. I might extend that time a little bit, but I think I might end up doing that. I think I might enjoy that a little bit more. Maybe pick out like a couple of things per category and just see what different combinations I can make. I don't know. I'm think I think I'm going to toy with that a little bit too though, because I really just want this channel to be about enjoying makeup and having fun with it and using what you've got and finding new ways to get creative and things like that. So if you've listened to me babble, thank you so much. We're going to jump into this unboxing now. I'm really excited. Okay, so Cause Box is a quarterly subscription box that features brands and items dedicated to doing good all over the world. Many featured brands donate a portion of proceeds to charities and or may employ local artisans, use ethically sourced goods, etc. Cause Box is $54.95 on a quarterly basis or it's $49.95 per box with an annual subscription. So I did sign up for an annual subscription so I do get to choose some of the things or colors or things like that in my box. Um, and then I don't know if that gives you like early access to the marketplace like it does with FabFitFun. I'd have to double check into that. And you get at least $150 worth of products for women from Cosbox's favorite socially conscious brands. So I'm really excited. We're gonna jump into this. Um, I don't know how my camera angle is because I've been moving my camera a lot. Um, since I've been doing so many declutters. So we're gonna hope that it looks pretty good. This is what the inside of the box looks like. I am really excited. I remember really enjoying Cause Box. Um, I ended up canceling it a couple years ago. I can't remember exactly why. I think it was just because there was no customization and I was getting things that I wasn't super stoked about. But I've been watching reviews for this box lately and I've really, really been liking the different customization options that I've seen. So this is the Fall 2020 box. You get this cute little catalog, which this I think is new because I don't recall ever seeing a catalog. Um, it's very, very similar to the FabFitFun catalog, I will say. And it does give you information on the different choices in the box. 
It also comes with a referral information, so I will leave a link down below. It looks like if you join, you get a free PMD microderm um, as a, an extra gift, so I will leave that link down below. I would also get a free PMD microderm, so if that makes you uncomfortable, uh, I'm sure you can Google, like, just for other links or something like that, but that link will be down below if you choose to use it, and if you do, I thank you. Okay, so the first thing we have is from a brand called bathin or bathin um you had two choices for this section you could pick between a waffle a bathrobe in mint or charcoal or a waffle towel set in mint or charcoal i ended up choosing the towel set because i typically use more towels than i do bathrobes i have a couple robes i just never use them but i figured these would be really great for the guest bathroom and they kind of go with the theme that i already have in there i got the charcoal shade because i tend to do a lot of gray tones in my house and the mint was adorable it just didn't match anything so these are a 90 dollars of value and it includes two bath and two hand towels i will say for being a waffle print they are really soft and i actually really like that um definitely better than i was expecting and I'm excited because these are going to look really cute, especially like I've been looking for almost like display towels to go over the towel rack in the guest bathroom and I can't find anything that I like, but these would be good for display slash usable towels. So I'm really excited about that because that takes care of that little design issue that I've been having. The next product was either the Tea's Tea Glass 3-in-1 Tea and Fruit Tumbler or the Artisan Direct Milky Way Lantern. Um, this one I did also have a choice on, so I chose the Artisan Direct Milky Way Lantern. The whole Tea and Fruit Tumbler, first of all, I don't drink tea I'm not a tea drinker um, you can use it for coffee or like fruit infusions too I don't drink coffee either um, and I don't know I'm just not like a fruit with water type person um, but I'm very into stars as like a decor theme and this lantern was beautiful so I chose to get this instead this has a retail value of $40 on it it is insanely well wrapped this is what the lantern looks like. It is so pretty and you can put a tea light inside of it um, and it'll illuminate just like the stars. I really like little tea light holders like this. I have zero clue as to where I'm going to put this right now, but it's beautiful and I might end up putting this in my bedroom. I don't know. I love this so much. It's going to be really hard. I wish I had more of these. It's going to be really hard to like figure out where I want this to go, but it is so gorgeous. I love that. The next section had three choices. It was either the Avalum Love Scrub, Aromatherapy Associates De-Stress Muscle Gel, or the Tribe Alive Rose Gold Criss Cross Cuff. Um, so the Aromatherapy Associates De-Stress Muscle Gel, I've actually used that before. It's pretty good. I just don't, like it's not something that I'm, I normally use. The Avalum Love Scrub sounded really good, but it is a scrub that I'm trying to take a, a little break away from those um, and then I ended up picking the Tribe Alive Rose Gold Crisscross Cuff. Now I remember Tribe Alive because even back when I was originally subscribed they were featuring Tribe Alive in the boxes and I really really love the brand. They make such beautiful products. This has a value of $42 and this is what it looks like. Definitely not the right outfit for it but I really like it. I think it's so cute. I love the simplicity of it. Um, I really like bracelets like this I've got a ton of little cuff bracelets and I love the rose gold on this because I mean I'm basic I really like rose gold but it's so pretty it's gorgeous I love that I'm very excited that that was the choice that I made for that one the next option had two choices the green company set of 10 reusable facial rounds or the buzzy seeds basil grow kit um, the basil grow kit we've tried several of those and we just, I don't know, they've never really worked out for us that great. So I decided to go ahead and skip that. And I ended up picking the Green Company, the uh, reusable cotton round set, because I have been using reusable cotton rounds. I no longer buy cotton balls. Um, I use these almost exclusively. I take that back. I do buy cotton balls for my nails, but now that I'm not doing my nails at home, now I'm no longer buying cotton balls. Um, but I've been using these almost exclusively for uh, like toner, any type of facial product that I have to put on with what would traditionally be a cotton ball, eye makeup remover, things like that. And I have been loving these. They're so easy to just throw in the wash. Mine have gotten a little stained, but when I run them through the wash, I run them through with a laundry sanitizer. So at least I know they're clean. And this 
set does come with its own wash bag. I just literally like wash them in this and it works out great. <gasps> and these are so cute. Okay, so these are white white. These will definitely 100% get stained, but I love this like mint. And it says that this replaces up to 12,000 cotton balls or facial rounds, which I've been using mine for a while now and they're holding up pretty well. It is made of bamboo fiber and cotton velvet. Um, you can also like hand wash these obviously, but like with the makeup that I wear, I find that these still tend to get stained regardless. So I typically just throw mine in the wash bag, throw it in the washing machine. Um, I don't use fabric softener when I put do a lot of these because it tends to take away from like the absorbency of any liquids. But I do use laundry sanitizer and that way I just know that it's super clean when I go to use it on my face. And I really like these. These are really great and these feel like super luxe, like way better than the ones that I have. I purchased mine off of Amazon and these just feel a lot like nicer. Okay, and then there are two products that are included in every fall box. The first is from Core Bamboo. It is a bamboo serve set. I'm actually really excited about this. This is so cute, first of all. Second of all, I really, really like um, using like bamboo products in my kitchen. I think they are so so great. I've been really into bamboo cutting boards and I actually I've been purchasing new cutting boards because we wear ours out really quick. I have no idea why. Like I have to assume it's because we're washing them wrong. <gasps> this this set comes with a pair of bamboo tongs which are adorable. It comes with a wooden spoon or is this a spatula? This isn't a spoon. Uh, but we have these. I use them a lot for cooking various things and then it comes with a really great bamboo cutting board which I am really excited for because like I said I really love the bamboo products. I have a ton of cooking utensils by the core brand in my kitchen. It's one of my favorite cooking brands and this actually makes me really happy because I get really weird about cooking and I'm really picky about my cutting boards and the bamboo ones are seriously some of the best. And the last product that comes in every fall box is the Way of Will Brightening Face Serum. This retails for $37.50. I just did a like mini skincare declutter. I didn't film that one because it wasn't super exciting and I just did like a pretty big skincare declutter so in my drawers. There's just not enough to really film for that. Um, but I got rid of a few of my serums that I wasn't super interested in because I wanted to make way for serums that I was interested in. And Way of Will is a brand that I have used before. They make some essential oils and I've used a couple of other things from them and I'm really excited to give this a try. Oh my god, that feels so good. It's really thick. It definitely has that like more all natural scent to it. But this is really nice. And look at how like hydrated my freaking hand looks right now. <gasps> this has a marula, black currant, and carrot in it. It is a vitamin rich. I'm really excited to try that out actually. I'm very obviously into um, serums as part of my skincare routine, which is probably why I have so many. But I really like these and I'm really excited to give that a try. Honestly, I will say I'm pretty happy with the fact that this box isn't like product heavy because obviously I'm trying to move kind of away from like product heavy boxes. I want to make sure that the products that are coming are products I'm actually going to use and want to use without getting too like overwhelmed by them. Um, so I'm, I'm really excited about this honestly because I think the products in here are all things that I'll use. I love the fact that I was able to customize four out of the six products in the box. I think it's a great value and I already did shop their marketplace. It opened up I think back in like August or September. And I ended up doing a shop there for some household stuff because obviously they have some really great sustainable household products, which is what I'm moving the family into. So that is a huge perk for me because it's really easy to get them and I can get them at a discount if I shop at the Cosbox Marketplace. So for me, that's just a huge perk to the subscription. But if I can be as happy as I am with this box with the future boxes, then this is definitely going to be a good box for me. So please let me know down below in the comments what you guys think about Cosbox. Are you subscribed? Are you interested in subscribing? Um, are you interested in the type of box that this is? It's more of like a lifestyle-y but like eco-friendly box as well. So let me know your thoughts down below. Please make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it and make sure you hit that subscribe button if you'd like to see more of me and all of the fun new direction videos this channel is taking. Yeah, you guys know what that meant, right? There's, there's, there's new stuff coming. We're going in a semi-new direction. We've got new stuff coming. I'm very excited about it. So if you like subscription boxes, if you like using what you have, if you like playing with makeup, if you like trying new makeup on an appropriate scale, then make sure you hit that subscribe button because that is what we do here. I will catch you guys next time. Have a good one. Bye.